Welcome to the Morning Cup of Trades live stream. It is currently 9.56 a.m. CST, August 14th, 2024, stream number 194. If you were watching this at a later time, you would be watching a recap of this live session. I will be taking trades in a funded prop firm account with Top Step, live with full transparency using only the price action and my own intuition. I take trades based on price action reversing off weakness or strength. Showing you the entry and exit points on the graph, running account balance, gross and net P&L, the instrument traded time from trade to specific time and date, as well as the session's performance stats. I do not, will not ever sell you a course, a book, an indicator, a trade alert, a mailing list, a mentorship, seminar, or any subscription-based program for trading, sharing information about trading that can otherwise be found for free with a Google search. Please see the disclaimer in the description of this content. Morning Cup of Trades is not responsible for trades or investments made by viewers. Trading and investing can have substantial financial risk, and it is advised to seek advice from a qualified broker or financial advisor before trading or investing. This stream is for entertainment purposes. I'm liking that. Let's do it. take it guys <laughs> that candle just plummeted right when I exited too yeah. it's just struggling too much up near this key level there's that candle man there's that weird candle where there's no candle body I think I might just enter back in on my long on the original long yeah I'm gonna do it I'm just gonna go in with one contract though we're back in with the long at 12 ATR. Yeah, I'm just gonna tag out. It was a good trade. It was a good trade. I tried to set up a little bit further of a move on the TP, but Ended up getting out less than I should have, to be honest. Should have gotten out at 20. Messing around with the brackets probably fucked up my head a little bit, but... All right, I'm in. Going down to the short side, guys. Here we go. It's likely going to get stopped out. Yeah, there it is right there. I'm still looking for that move though. All right, we're good. Get in, damn it. There we go. All right, we're good. We're in. Coming off of 50. It's what we should have waited for originally. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and add two contracts. We're in with 10 ATR. 10 ATR is about what we're sitting at. Okay. tick big ticky after the very first sign of reversal after a huge drop like this it almost always has a little pullback yeah i'm not convinced that this is the reversal i'm just not there's something about it you know when you have a big move to the downside or upside that first sign is always a bust that's that's in my experience i've noticed that i almost feel so confident about that that i i would just put in one contract might as well, right? Break-even's in play. I might as well just let this thing sit and see how far we can go. This was like a bus trade. I didn't even really... <laughs> I didn't even really want to get in on this. I was just kind of proving that the pullback works pretty well. And look at this shit. This is crazy. Are we going to make more? 40 points? 41, 44, 45...
Dude, craziness. I'll take it. 45 points, baby. 45 points. Let's go. All right. All right, all right. Hey, I don't know what that trade was, but I will say this. We didn't get in with any strategy. So uh, that was just luck. I'm going to say that. That was just a lucky trade. I am getting in on a reversal, though. We'll see if it works out. Coming off of 19.1. We'll see if we can get down on some weakness. Looks like we might just get break broken out even on both. That's that's a bummer, man. I mean, we definitely had a good run on this. I mean, shit. We had 78, 83. We had a lot. We almost got out with the TPs. Just couldn't quite get there. I should have known, though. I should have known that coming in in 1950, this key level was going to be a prime support. And it supported the price big time. Early closure might have been the move on that whenever it immediately rejected. But this was very hard to read. It looked like there was a lot of strength or a lot of weakness coming in very fast. So this bounced up immediately within seconds. So we might lose like a tad on the trade. Not much though. Break even should have been in play on this, but I guess maybe how it all ironed out. I don't know. We lost there. We lost a few points. Nothing too crazy. I'm in, guys. We're going to play off 19-1 uh, reversal here. wild man we just got broke out even for the second time in a row after realizing over 20 points damn near 30 points on both of them I'm hopping in right now on a short Still a good win. Still a really good win on one of the contracts. One of the contracts just broke out even. I'm gonna do it, man. I'm getting in one contract. Let's see what we can make out of it. It's been such a weird day, man. This is actually really good. I'll take it. I'm taking this trade. It's power hour. Reversal's coming in, breaking through 100. Setup's playing out. I'm just going to take it, guys. I'm tired of the back and forth. 
That brings us back to 100 for like the fourth time today, it feels like. It's just been so back and forth. I'm just going to end it. Oh, damn it. Yeah, it's rough. I'm just, I'm so tired of the, uh, the back and forth. After these really big drops, there's all this weakness, and then it just completely sidelines and explodes the other way. It's, it's doing it too much, so I don't know. I'm just going to, I'm going to take it when I have it. It's happened to us, that would have been the third time if we would have sat through this and saw it go all the way to break even again. I'm just not going to do it. Although I bet you it probably works out in our favor. It's irritating. It probably does, doesn't it? That's going to go to 70. There's 70. Yep, yep, there it goes. Fucking sloppy trading today, dude. Jesus, so sloppy. So sloppy. Should have still been on this trade. I got scared out. I didn't let it be a systematic trade. 70 was our original TP, and we closed it early at 82. Yeah, a lot of journaling today, boys. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm disappointed in myself. There's our 55. We would have hit it. We would have certainly hit it. Damn, I'm, I'm really disappointed. Very disappointed. Thank you for tuning in to the Morning Cup of Trades live stream recap. It is currently August 14th, 2024. I stream weekdays around 9 a.m. CST. I post recaps of all live streams around 3.30 every single day, as well as the correlating shorts of those trades. If you're interested in a prop firm evaluation, please check out the description or the comment of this content. I do not condone anyone purchase evaluation unless they are confident in their ability to pass. Using my code or link does support me at no extra cost to you, so thank you for that. See you all in the next one. Goodbye for now.